Mike, uh, what did you see different about Lance today after his complete shutout last game? Um, just didn't have it. I mean, that's you hate to have uh, a couple of those happen in the same series, but that's exactly what happened. And um, I don't know if there's a, another way to explain it. I bricks on the knee. Is that what was going on out there? Um, yeah, banged it a little bit as he went over to cover. Post game update on him to everything or? seems to be clear right now. Take another look in the morning. What about Craig? Um, he said he felt fine. Didn't have any any symptoms of anything. Um, but uh, just kind of getting him out of there when the game got got to the point where it was. And uh, but he didn't have any any uh, symptoms of any ramifications of getting hit right there. Did you see anything different in Lynn's stuff after he had that 126 pitch uh, outing the other day? Yeah. Well, that could be it. You know, you know, I thought his velocity looked about the same, um, but that's an easy place to go. What would you rather seen Wong? Did Wong rush that play trying to get two before he had one on the double? You no, know, that's, that's a play he's done here in the last yeah. week a couple times, and you know the odds of, of getting Blanco on that particular play aren't real high. Um, but if we get a force out of second base and we're still in position to maybe do something, uh, you know, hindsight, we'd like to have an out, yeah, but I'm not going to slow him down, his aggressiveness. I want him to make make athletic plays because he can. The, the workload Martinez had today, and I guess maybe even Seth uh, might need to call down Memphis for reinforcements or where? Yeah, he should be all right. We've got a few guys that didn't, didn't pitch today. How, how disturbing is it to be down 7 to nothing three of the last five games here? Yeah, disturbing. Yeah. And, um, it's not, uh, not how we... Uh, we draw them up. Um, tough. It's tough on our offense. Obviously, the pitchers are taking a beating when that happens, and you know that just wears them down. Like I said, you're going to have some guys throw some really good games. You look at one of Lance's best games we've ever seen from him, um, and then this happens. We've seen Wayno have one of the best months of, of any best couple months of any starter in baseball, and you're just going to have those days. Um, but they're they're tough on an offense to keep trying to fight and get back into it. And a couple times we really have today, we just couldn't get anything going. What did, what did you see in Martinez and Mott both today? Yeah. So Martinez threw the ball well and um, looked like he had a, had a good pace. He wasn't trying to do too much. I think knew, he knew he was going to be out there for a little while. Um, had better control of the plate. His off-speed stuff, he was actually had had uh, really good mechanics on his off-speed. Didn't didn't uh, sh- slow down on him at all or tip him in any way. He, uh, he looked good with the secondary pitches and Mott threw the ball well. Mott's getting outs. Did Osborne do anything different? Seen all the years. He's had a good season. I mean, the guy's just pitching. He makes pitches. The fact that Mott's pitched, I think, six times in 11 days now, does that indicate to you that everything's all right with him physically and everything else? Yeah, he's um, bouncing back well, and you know, he's keeping his counts low when he does get an opportunity. And um, I think we're consistently seeing his stuff look um, look more more like what we're used to, and, um, and he's able to execute in, in tough counts. Do you think you might have Martinez? Do one more of those things, mid-game uh, outings, rather than, than rushing back to late inning stuff right away. Or? Um, you know, we're not going to him ourselves in here on how that plays out. He, uh, he did a nice job today, and, and uh, just build on having a real good outing today.